what you just saw in action was a short, simple gyro sensor program used to keep the robot going straight no matter what happens to it. This video is a tutorial on how to make and use the gyro sensor program. First I'll explain how it works, then I will get to how to make it. The first thing that happens in the program is it resets the gyro sensor, so wherever the robot is pointing at that time will be zero degrees. Then it enters the loop that continues going around until the robot has traveled a certain distance. For example, I have it at five degree, five rotations. Inside the loop, it reads what the gyro sensor angle is as it's going forward. If the gyro sensor angle equals zero, then it takes zero, it takes, plugs it into zero, subtract zero. That keeps the turn variable at zero, so it keeps on going straight. But if the gyro sensor detects that it has gotten off course, say 10 degrees, it'll subtract 10 degrees from zero, causing the turn variable to become negative 10. This corrects it back on course, and it does this many times over a short period of time. Now let's get into how to make the program. Here I am with a blank canvas. The first thing I'm going to do is rename this program Gyro Straight Tutorial. Tutorial. The first step in the making of the program is to go to the yellow sensor tab. From there, we're going to drag the gyro sensor block up to beside the play button. Click the tab and set it to reset. After you do that, go to the orange flow control tab and get a loop. For time being, we will leave it at infinite. The next thing you want to do is go back to yellow, the yellow sensor tab, and take the gyro sensor. Put it here and keep it on measure angle. It is pre-chosen for you once you select the block. Then go to the red data operations tab. Pull out from there a math block. Put it in and change this part to subtract. Change the A value to zero and click and drag this tab here into the B value. Now we have a data wire making the gyro sensor reading put it into here. So it's zero subtract whatever the gyro sensor reads. Next we will get a move steering block in the green action tab. Pull it up beside your math block and turn it to on. You turn the speed to whatever you want, in this case I'm going to keep it at 50, and plug this tab into the turn variable. Next, you need to set your gyro sensors to port value to whatever your port is. I have it on 3, so I'm going to like select 3 for both of these. Then, we don't want it to go straight forever, so we need to choose when we want this loop to stop. The best and easiest thing to do is go to Motor Rotation, Measure Rotations. We want to move it to greater than or equal to. That is 3 on the tab bar. Then put it in however many rotations you want it to go before stopping. In this case, I'm going to do 5. And that is all for your program. Now you can download it to your brick by pressing this button and run it. It will go straight no matter if you hit it or not. Thank you for watching. Goodbye.